Yo, 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 what is up, squad? We are back with another Bloody Nights video. Guys, I know, I know, guys. I've been lacking so hard. I've been slacking with my grind on this game, bro. I just have not been home lately. And, like, oh my gosh, bro. I have been slacking so hard because this is one of those games where, in order to level up, you need to put in time, bro. You need to sit in front of your computer for, like, two hours, like, to level up, bro. If you want to get this stuff done, bro, you actually got to put in time. This game is no joke when it comes to leveling. But, 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 I have been, you know, doing, you know, a little bit of work here and here and there, here and there. So, your boy actually, I can't even speak today. Your boy actually managed to unlock every move for the Rize Kagune so it did take me it didn't take me too long but you know like I said I've been slacking but I did manage to unlock every skill so now I was like you know what I gotta show the squad all the skills for this Kagune in case you know some of them are like yeah I'm not sure if I want to keep it or not bro because I because you know everybody knows that this this Kagune does not have the best base damage compared to other Kagunes but what it does have going for it is its amazing range and its OP skills. Everybody knows that this Kagune has some amazing crazy range. I'm pretty sure it has the most range out of all the Kagunes uh, in the game so far. And I think it has like the most range out of anything in the game. I'm pretty sure and the CCG doesn't have anything that has more range besides probably their guns, I would assume. But other than that, everyone knows that you know when it turns to you know physical attacks everybody knows that this kagune is superior to any other kagune or kinke in the game okay now with that being said what do you, what you want from me bro what you what you want bro what you is you crazy first of all let me show you off this first move real quick i missed that but let's see let's see uh, uh, yeah 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 everybody gotta die now because this dude matthew wanted to be stupid that's what happens when you have somebody stupid next to you. R.I.P. to that other dude that was just minding his own business, but Matthew had to make it so that everybody had to take an L and die, okay? So, uh, like I was saying, bro, before I was really interrupted, uh, everybody knows that this Kagune has, like, the opiate skills and the opiate range, all right? With that being said, I want to show you guys the first skill that I did unlock. I did unlock the strength skill first. So I was like, you know what? I want to put everything into strength so I can level up faster, obviously. And then I'll do agility later. So with the first strength skill, that was like, I think it's like 25. You need 25 strength. We got this right here, which is kind of like, you know, like a barrage of attacks or whatever. It's like a little, uh, it's like a little, oh, wrong button. It's like a little, yeah, that's what it is. It's like, it reminds me kind of like a spider just going ham. And it doesn't have as much range. You know, it's like one of those, uh, it's a skill that does require you to get pretty close. You know, sadly, like, like I said, this, what makes this, um, Kagune, like, so OP is its range. But with that skill, you do have to get pretty close. But it does dash out a lot of damage in, like, a short, uh, period of time. So if you're going to get someone with, like, a short, uh, Kagune that doesn't have a lot of range, like, uh, maybe, like, a, not, not Tiao. Tiao has decent range. But you can still get pretty close with the, against a Tiao. You just get in. Boom, 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 boom. And you do that, bro. If you want to sacrifice, you know, take a chance of sacrificing some, a little bit of HP, you can keep going. Like, this can go, this can do damage. It just depends how much, how willing you are to stay close to the target. Because it does do a little pushback. So, that's something that you do have to take note of. It does have a pushback. So, when you use the skill, you want to keep moving forward. And if you want to, if you're willing to, like, you know, leave yourself vulnerable to be hit, then by all means, go ahead. Now, with the next strength skill, this did require, uh, let me think, I think it was like 65 strength I needed? I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, this one's OP. It has some really nice range. And it has like, it's kind of like a three-part attack. Well, So it's not just one attack, it's like, mm, mm, mm. Um, I've mastered the last two parts, but I've, I can, I bar I rarely get the first hit in. Because, like, it's, as you can see, it has the, it has three lunges, which are really OP. The, the, the last two have crazy range the first one's kind of like it has to be spot on bro for the first one to do damage let me see if i can get it in again let's see oh my god you see that first one that first one that i did that didn't do anything that one has to be like spot on bro like spot on i think when they because i do know they like mess with like the hitboxes of this uh this kagune 
I think they like completely threw that off. Cause it has to be like, I don't even know how if what's considered spot on, bro. It has to be like on the tip, bro. It has to be like on the tip of the Kagune for it to do any any damage, bro. And it's like, jeez, bro, like how spot on do you want a man to be? How spot on you want us to be, bro? Now with the last skill, I haven't mastered this one yet. I actually just got it, and I'm still like kind of figuring out how it works. It's kind of like a lunge forward, literally. It's like that's literally what it is. So I just you have to be able to time it properly. You have to know like how far you are. So let's see. Oh, uh, there we go. That's pretty cool. That's pretty dope. So it's like a lunging skill. So if you if you're like let's say this far, you want to close in some distance. There you go. That's all you gotta do. And then you just boom, 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 boom. You know, go in ham on him. Go in ham. That's all you gotta do. That's you know, you can really combo these skills if you do know how to. Uh... First of all, what you want to do, you definitely want to memorize the animation. You want to memorize the animation and have a good uh, idea of how the hitbox works, uh, how like how much range the hitbox has, and all that. You want to have a good idea. So, like I said, you want to be able to tell, like, uh, you want to be able to guesstimate how much, uh, how much space you need, how much space you don't need, how close you do or do not need to get, how far you need to be, especially with that last skill. You do need to know how far you need to be. That's a skill that you know. I feel like it can be dodged easily if, like, uh, look at that. And then you just go, mm, you just go like this. You just go in on them, bro. You just go in on them. And to be honest, I don't think you really need. Oh shoot. How did I die to an NPC, bro? That T.I. That T.I. was deceiving, bro. That T.I. has a deceiving hitbox. Anywho, um, like I was saying, bro. Uh, like, for, for, what was I saying, bro? Oh, yeah, for this kind of good name, I don't really think you need anything in your cooldown, um, your cooldown stat, just because of, like, this kind of good name. The attacks are pretty straightforward, so it doesn't really require you to have a cooldown just because it's like you know, so whatever. Because of how the animations work, like, there's no point in like shortening your cooldown because you're just gonna have to wait for the animation, anyways. So, like, right here, let's see, let's see what we can do right here. Mm. Mm. I missed. Uh. All right, let's try this again. All right, all right, ready for this? You're gonna hit on with this, uh, mm. bro. I'm mm. you see, guys, bro, you, you, gotta, you gotta know how much. As you see, bro, this game's not just pressing buttons, bro. You gotta know what you're doing. Uh, then you hit him with that, and you just hit him with this. Uh, I ran, I ran out of stamina, bro. I ran out of stamina. I was planning to do the meanest combo, and I ran out of stamina, and I was not even paying attention, bro. So we're gonna pretend like that fail did not just happen, okay? That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna pretend like the fail did not just happen. You know, look past it. Can I reset? No, I don't think this. Game, no, this game doesn't have any resetting. Uh, here, hit me, hit me, kill me. Kill me, kill me. Oh my gosh, you're so weak. Just kidding, you're actually pretty OP. Uh, actually, I don't even have anything to in health or defense. Uh, I hate when games put both a health and defense stat, bro, because it's just like, oh my gosh. Why would you do that? Why, just why, for what? Like, they literally, like, why couldn't you just make it one, one stat and just make them correspond with each other, bro? Or make it that. You gain HP, you gain health as like as you level up. Your HP and stamina max increases as you level up, bro. Like that's the only reason I was able to tolerate it in uh, Final Stand. Final Stand they had a stamina and HP max stat, but it was like it did it as you level like increase it as you level up. So it was like no one really needed like to put anything in there. You just kind of left it alone. But now it's like oh my gosh, now you just. Why? Just why, bro? Okay, let's try this combo again, bro. Okay, not on this go, I guess. Uh, let's try it on this dude. Oh yeah, the dude with Noro. Come here, get over here. Wow, I, I, they just go like, uh, uh, uh. It's like you see, you see that, bro. You see that, you see them combos, bro. You see them combos, dude. That's all you gotta do, bro. That's all you gotta do. You just gotta, you just gotta go in on them, bro. Just, mm, mm. And you just, uh, uh, uh. just like that, bro. Just like that, bro. Oh, how I get a move? You need to, hold up, have a Kagune that has skills. All right. Now, for the code. I know you guys have been waiting for this code. You guys, you know, some of you guys saw the code. He's like, new code? Okay, yeah, code that shows the code already. All right, so you want to come to that health. The new code is Underground War coming soon. Let's see what it gives us. Ooh, 20k yen, bro. So we got 100k yen. We have 100k yen. I want to see what we can do with 100k yen now. Cause and it did give me a lot of spins. I've been stacking up on spins, bro. So I feel like I don't know how many spins I got, but I know I've been stacking up. I've been saving my spins. 
I might I might spin for a rare pretty soon. I'm still not sure if I want to give up this uh, Kagune because it's, it's like I said, it's like probably the one with the most OP range and the one with the most uh, the most uh, OP skills. So uh, I'm not sure if I want to give this up yet. I, I want to see what the V2 looks like. I want to see all that. So let's see what we can get with 100 KN. Um, no, bro. I want the. I already know what I'm gonna go for. Kaneki's first mask, bro. I do. I don't. I probably do not have enough Kukaku for that. Uh, let's see. What about for his movie mask? I have enough yen. Let's see how. Do I have enough? Let's see my. Hmm. That's interesting. Let's see his movie mask and his first mask. Let's see the difference. I want to see the difference. What's the difference between his movie mask and his first mask? All right. So his movie mask just has the little like. What is that stitching? I guess it has the stitching. That's the difference. I don't know. Uh, all right, let's see, let's see. How many, how much, how, let's see, let's see, inventory, inventory. Oh, I actually have enough for both, bro. I have 1,000. I didn't even notice. Bro, I'm about to cock this right now, bro. His movie mask. I want his movie mask. Let's see. Can I get it? Can I get it? Yes. Craft? Hello? Oh, I got it. Let's go. I got it? Yes, I do, and now I'm poor. Okay, let's get it. Your boy's poor now. Mask. Yes, sir. Equip. 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 Let's go. Let's go. Okay. And look at that. Killer kid. I am not no F rank, bro. Don't don't disrespect me like that. What you talking about F rank, bro? How do I how do I rank up, bro? Be honest. Be real with me. How do I rank up, bro? I'm not no F rank. <laughs> but yeah, we finally got our first mask, dude. We finally got the first mask. We got the most expensive mask while at it, bro. Okay, okay. That's actually going to be all for today's video. Thank you so much, guys, for tuning in. Hope you guys did enjoy. I hope it was helpful. And if it was, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And if you are subscribed and haven't done so, hit the notification bell so you know when your boy uploads some new codes. You want to see those codes and you want to get them before they expire. You want to get them right away. I will get those codes to you right away. So you definitely want to do that. You also want to be able to get all my cool methods and life hacks that I will be dropping. Every now and then, you want to be the first people to see some of these new updates that I will be providing you guys with. So, with that being said, until next time, guys, we are out. Please don't throw your love.